Yo, what's happening? It's your boy Buddha. I'm the South Carolina Prince. Go follow my IG at B U D D H A underscore S M E. You are watching Hip Hop Weekly. And go check out my new single. It's called Living Like. Screaming on all platforms. Hip hop weekly cover. Hip hop weekly cover. Hip hop weekly cover. Cover, cover, cover. Okay, Hip Hop Weekly All Access. This is Brienne, and we're here live today with the one and only Buddha. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? How you doing? How you doing? I'm good. I'm good. Mm-hmm. Welcome to Hip Hop Weekly. Introduce I, yourself. I appreciate you for having me, man. Um, I'm Buddha. That's B U D D H A underscore S M. You can follow me at IG on that right there. I'm the South Carolina Prince. Okay, I represent South Carolina too. That's where I'm from. Oh, look at that. Mm-hmm. Florence. Florence. I'm from Georgetown, South Carolina. Okay. Okay. Like well, that, again, bro. the Carolinas, we, you know, we represent right now. You know, uh, definitely, uh, definitely. Oh, my God, that's son. Definitely. So, you know, let's get into it. Um, What inspired you to get in the industry? Um, Just like uh, me just having a passion for music, you mm-hmm. know what I mean? Especially good music, you know what I mean? Like, that's it. That's what I want to make. I want to make good music. Okay. Who inspires you to, you know, who did you look up to, like, growing mm-hmm. up? Like growing up, man. Like honestly, mm-hmm. me growing up, like as far as like you saying in the industry or just in general, me looking up. Well, just you know, musically. Um, musically, inclined. but yeah. yeah, musically, you know what I mean. I grew up listening to you know, of course, like trap rappers like Jeezy, you know, Rick Ross, and we talking R and B, we talking Usher, um, Trey Songz, stuff like that, right there. So pretty much some stuff like that, right there, like really made me want to, you know, made me want to get into music. Okay. Okay. Cool. Cool. So, in your music, uh, what kind of vibes can we expect? You can you can expect a a story vibe, like a storyline vibe. And when it comes to R and B, you can expect a sexy vibe. When it comes to, you know, it depends on the production. You know what I mean? It's what the production mm-hmm. the production brings it out. Brings okay. It out, you know what I mean? Exactly. Okay. Type of what to expect? Okay. Mm-hmm. Because you do a little bit of both. You like rap and you sing. Yeah, I, I heard yeah. you have like one of the, you know, an amazing voice uh, for R&B. Yeah, thank you. Uh, which one do you prefer? Like, you know, is it, do you prefer one over the, over the other? Yeah, I do. I, pres- I prefer a, mod- a more modalic style approach. A more, okay. A more smooth approach than, uh, yeah. Okay. So you, you, you prefer to cater to the ladies and I stuff? I prefer to cater to the ladies. Okay. Okay. Ladies. All right. Okay. So... You know, can we expect any shows or anything yet? Um, I've seen um, you've been moving around. Yeah, we've been um, moving around, just working. Um, so we're still working right now, not booking just yet because we're working. Right, um, right. So they're trying to just lay the foundation first and then uh-huh. and then can take off from there. Okay. What are you pushing? What's your music? Like, what what single well, are you um, pushing? Okay, well, right now we got a, a single. Well, I have a single called uh, Living Like. You know what I mean? It's a sexy record, man. Um. I want everybody to go and check it out. It's on all all platforms. It's streaming right now, and um, and yeah, and then I act uh, and shortly after that, I'll be releasing my EP. Okay, it's called uh, Hustler's Testimony. It's gonna be dope. You know what I mean? So okay, you should go check it out. It's like my story. Okay, can we expect any collaborations from any mainstream artists on it, or just anybody? You well, yeah, I got with? a collaboration on it with uh with Mo Three is an artist out of uh, Dallas, Texas. Okay, and yeah, he's pretty dope. Okay, all right. And you have a collaboration with uh, Lil Boosie too, right? Yeah, I got a collaboration with Boosie, yeah. Uh, so it was more like a it was more like a trap record. Uh, okay. Run it up. It was pretty dope, too. Okay. How was it like working with him? It was cool, you know what I mean? Like, I can't uh, can't complain. Uh, it was, you know what I mean? It was cool getting to work with somebody who was already, like, been in the game for so long. Right. You know, considered an OG, you know what I mean? We kind of take them type of pointers and stuff like that, so yeah. Okay. Anybody else you aspire to work with? Uh man, yeah, of course, man. Um, when it come to R and B, especially R and B female, uh, LMA, um, mm-hmm. uh, of course, like you know, a Meek Mill, you know, something like that, right there. Mm-hmm. You, know, you got dudes like who hot right now, like out the Carolinas, like the baby. You mm-hmm. know what I mean? You want to mm-hmm. work with? You want to always kind of bring it on, stuff like that. Yeah. Right. So, yeah. how did you um? Get connected to uh you know to official. I know he's managing you now. Like, what was that experience like? Like, how how did that you know how did that come about? Uh, like man, um, uh, man, initially, man, it was from the from the time, man. Like I said, it was like a match made in heaven, man. He a good, he a good dude, man. He like family, you know. What I mean, all from day one, you know, what I mean, he's like taking me in, like, oh, like this, my my little brother type thing, right? He, you know, what I mean, wanting to help me out, you know, what I mean, like, so I wouldn't be like, you know, making all of the wrong moves, right? You know what I mean? At least trying to like steer me in the right direction, um. So uh, what he did initially was uh, 
when I was trying to push the Boosie record, he initially did my promotion and you know, he was helping me get out there, like raising, raising the awareness about Buddha, about my brand more right. than even the music at that time. Yeah, so from there, like, I was like, yeah, he's he going to be good to work with. You know, so, yeah. Okay. Do you see yourself um, pretty much just, you know, wanting to kind of like stay with the independent uh, route or, you know, just. Well, like, what did you think? when it comes to stuff like that, it had to make sense. You know what I mean? Of okay. course, I, of course, you know what I mean? Me mainstream, you know what I mean? You want to, everybody want a big check. You know what I'm saying? Right, right. Um, but yeah, it just everything had to make sense. You know what I mean? It would make sense, not just for me, for my team, you know what I mean? For my family, like everybody just had to make sense. Okay. So uh, being that you you are from uh, South Carolina and mm-hmm. you've been in in Atlanta, um, where, where else have you traveled? Have you performed anywhere you know else domestically? Oh, yeah. Um, we've been on, on this uh, Hustlers Testimony Tour, man. We've been everywhere, man. like the whole southeastern region. Okay. Like, when it comes to the southeastern region, like it ain't been nowhere. I ain't been yet. Okay. Um, yeah, I've been running for, yeah, we've been running for a while. Okay, cool, cool. All right. So what else can we expect from you going forward? You know, what can we, you know... Uh, look just going to? forward, man, you can just ex- just expect, you know what I mean, like, to see me working. You know what I mean? To see me grinding. Oh, I see it. Yeah, I, I see definitely working, see man. it. You see me grinding, like, nonstop, man. You steady, just, like, steady punching at it, man. You know what I mean? Until the break. Definitely, definitely. Mm-hmm. Well, I cannot wait to, you know, hear more of your music. Um, and you said you don't know when the EP is dropping yet. Uh, we uh, um, still working on it, right? Yeah, we still we still okay. working on it. We pretty much finished, but we uh we 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 had to set a date, exact date. So yeah. Okay. All right. You are you pushing any merchandise or anything yet? Oh uh, no, not not really. You know what I mean? Just the logo, man. Just like so, when they see the Buddha, they know exactly who I am. You know, what I mean? we getting it out there first. That's the okay. main thing. Where did that name come from, Buddha? Buddha, man. Um, actually, man, like it came from my uncle. And my and my friend, man, Marcus, and boys always tell me like I was like pretty much like wise beyond my years and I was just like always eating like a big dog, like the big man, like the fat man right here, Buddha. With the feet. Just always eating, just always up to something, getting some money, trying to stay full. <laughs> okay, okay. You see yourself staying in music, um, in, in this longevity, or do you wanna like kinda jump into something else? You know? Yeah, like I mean, like the thing is like I say, music that's my passion. I love to make music, um, make me happy. You know what I mean? So, I, like, I would love to be doing it for a long period of time. And, you know, something else calls, you know what I mean? Because, you know, a lot of times, you know, you get in the film and stuff right. like that, you know, acting. So, if it, if it's like that, then, you know what I mean? We take, I'm, I'll most definitely be ready to take on the challenge, um, stuff like that. Absolutely, absolutely. Was there anything else you want us um, to know about you? Anything else you want to promote uh, that I didn't ask you about? Nah, not really. You know what I mean? Not nothing besides my, my IG for everybody to come and follow me to see. That I'm lit. Okay. Yeah. All right. And right now, your current single is streaming on all platforms, on all right? platforms, literally. Okay. They got okay. to go and get it. It's a very sexy record. Okay. Definitely. Definitely. Well, it was a pleasure speaking with you. Uh, we do appreciate you for checking in and taking the time to speak to Hip Hop Weekly. Uh, thank you. No problem. All right. <laughs>